Let's play Unknown Back with more Pandora's Tower. And uh, talking with Elena. I guess at the moment we'll just uh, grind some emotion with her. Here, I brought you some of my meat. Yes, none of us want to watch you eat that. Alright, you're asleep. We have a bit more of that with you. My door won't stop squeaking! The Cellar. There are a lot of different books. There's a, There are a lot of books and other documents. Some of them are very old. There's bound to be some worth holding on to. It's well worth having a search for these texts. Thanks for the obvious part that I've been doing already. Ooh, a little plant. That wasn't the button. Hello. Hey, Mavda. I got some stuff for you. Yeah. Ooh. All right, I still have to go over that. What? Can I upgrade anything? No, I don't want to use this. Um, what can I create? Any gifts? No. What? What am I? Need? A lump of metal? All right. What takes a lump of metal? up. Put him through all that shit. Mm, nothing else I want. Thanks, Mavda. You're awesome. Uh, what other gifts can I buy for Alina? Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, apparently nothing. You haven't restocked. Tell me something. Yeah, she'll repair stuff. Oops. Well, says you, you know how to live here. Don't even joke about that. Thanks, Mavda. You're a bitch. Right, I never went over what Elena translated. Oh! A chain of destiny. In a far-flung border region across... Oh, my foot is numb. Region... Live the Vestra. Curious people. Rumor has it they have some sort of chain and all kinds of odd ancient ceremonies to cure illness and to help crops grow. My foot is numb like hell. They call this ceremonial item the Oracleous Chain. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. What we're wearing. Although we don't know whether or not it's true, they claim to, that this is not some kind of magic trickery. Rather, it was born out of respect of, for life and the laws of nature. Now, as the war grows worse, they set out from the borders and regions and roam the lands, seeking a safe place to shelter. The elders of Ios regard them as a nuisance, but with their chain, if with, but within the chain is true power, and so they are careful not to make an enemy of them. Who knows how things will develop? The chain's meaning. On my pilgrimage, I came across a woman from the Vesture tribe, using a chain to heal those wounded in battle. And when I inquired about the chain, she answered me, laughing all the while. The chain was formed from two lengths of a glowing golden material. She said it remorsed light and darkness. <coughs> she said this was the masculine and feminine. Notice how, uh, you know, uh... Got Aaron and Elena there. It shows the bonds that link the world together, while its length represents the passage of time. So, in other words, the shit that we already know. When we finished speaking, she's, the woman disappeared. She said there were people all to the east who required her assistance. She comes out. She comes from another land, but I pray the gods of Ios watch over her on her travels. Vessel treatment two. 
I volunteered to become a vessel to atone for my sins. As a medic at the front, I tended the wounded. Comra adds as my wounded comrades as the carnage continued and the casualties mounted. But as the war spread, it became more difficult to get a hold of the medicine and equipment I needed. The cries of the wounded haunt me still, as they pleaded with me to put them out of the misery. And, and I did it. I ended their lives, sending them on to the afterwards to meet the gods of Ios. But I did not do it for them. I did it to escape those cries. Now all I can do, by the way, of atonement is to try and bring about peace for this... For the children of those victims. You're a dick. <laughs> Eternal blessings. Far from. Far beyond. Blah, blah, blah. Far beyond the dawn, light glimmers illuminating the blessed, bountiful earth. The great mother of us all. I pray to her as dancing light plays over her better. better pff, fuck that V word. Forests and lush meadows. That sweet melody clear as day, as clear as the summer sky, is like a beacon that guides us as we open the door to each new day. We offer, a, we offer our joy and gratitude. Let our memories and dreams live on through endless time, endless horizons. I pray to the ocean, father of us all. Let its sweet song as radiant stars shine, a light to guide us as we open the door to tomorrow. Let the maiden smile fill the mellows of light. Let her sing eternally. Brings us joy without cease. I vow to give you eternal love. Let us be bound together in joy as the sky is bound to the earth as we pass through endless time. Is that some kind of, like... marriage thing? Wow, I took up a lot of time just reading all that shit. I think it takes two hours sometimes. Hey, Elena, you're awake. Thank you for everything. Hey, what's up? You're yeah, yeah. Yes. Yay, more emotion. Anything else? Yeah, yeah. Oops. Gift time! Here, have a bracelet. It's so beautiful. Is it really for me? Maybe I'll try it on for now. Yeah, yeah. I've never seen so many colors on the bracelet. Look at how they all blend into each other. Pretty, aren't they? It's like a rainbow. Rainbow scales! Oh, that's good. Wow, Elena, you go really deep with all this, don't you? A few people can actually hear this. I'm turn up the volume just a little bit. Okay, there we go. All right, should probably put this stuff in the bank. Uh, oh, put that in there. Nah. All right. Time to grind a little bit of emotion before we end this. Elena's just uh, chilling out. Nope. Did something happen? No. Hmm. You heard it too. It was really odd, wasn't it? Yeah, well, might as well go with that one. Oh, poor Lena. Oh. Anyway, Aaron, let's sleep. Oh, geez, don't sleep that long. Jesus Christ, man. Morning. No, don't rest. Talk. No, don't rest. Talk. Hmm. Not enough time. It 
YOLO. Yes. You are looking way too much into this, lady. Alright, that's done. Okay, saving and quitting. Ooh, let's stop!